tree frogs make up one of the most species-rich extant frog families. The family, Hylidae, is also referred to as the true tree frogs, because some frogs classified in other families are also commonly known as tree frogs. It can all be a little confusing when common names are involved. Technically speaking, the common tree frog isn't really a true tree frog. There are over 1,000 classified species in the true tree frog family. Some of their other common names include leaf frogs, chorus frogs, brook frogs, and burrowing frogs. The name Hylidae has the Greek root meaning wood, which was likely applied to this family for their wood living behavior. Even their scientific name alludes to their arboreal homes. Many of the tree frog genus names reference trees as well. For example, this genus name means something like alien tree, and this genus name means unseen in the tree. Plus, the red-eyed tree frog's name means beautiful tree. There's even a tree frog whose name means ghost. Remember how the ring-tailed lemur's scientific name means ghost cat? The lemur frog shares the same name, lemur. This frog is critically endangered. Most tree frogs are scansorial amphibians. This means that they have the ability to climb and often perform this. It makes sense considering many of them spend a lot of their time in trees. Tree frogs, like all other frogs, don't have ribs. Ribs in humans help us push air in and out of our lungs. But since frogs don't have these, they raise and lower the floor of their mouth to move air in and out of their bodies. That's why they do that throat thing. Although these frogs live all around the world, except Antarctica, of course, there aren't any living frogs in Antarctica, though there are frog fossils there. Tree frogs are almost entirely absent from Africa. The shrinking frog is a species of tree frog. It's called the shrinking frog because its tadpoles are upwards of four times as large as the adults, so they actually shrink as they age. They're also known as the paradoxical frog for this reason. Marsupial frogs are frogs that brood their eggs in a brood sac located on the female's body. There isn't a free-living tadpole stage. Originally, marsupial frogs were described as part of the tree frog family, but they have since been reclassified. You've also probably heard that tree frogs don't all live in trees and all have claw-shaped toes. But if you weren't aware of these facts, you can learn all about them and more in our full tree frog episode. There's a card on screen you can click right now. Go ahead, click it. There's lots to learn. And thanks for watching Animal Fact Files.